In this video, I'm going to be talking about emblem design and some of the history behind it. Then, I'll show you how to make your own. What is an emblem? Here are some early medieval examples. They were used to denote victories in family professions. Most people had one they would use on seals and official documents. Those original crests began to evolve into something more modern. Rather than being full color, many people began drawing 2D versions of them. Modern brands eventually began to appropriate the crest style for use in logos. It's a great way to signify authority in an area. You are the best of the best in your field. As we said before, emblems often represent brands and families. However, the symbols within them are used to represent abstract concepts such as bravery, trust, and honor. Porsche is a great example of an enduring crest. Theirs has remained the same since its creation. It is used to represent characteristics of the company's origin city. As we said, emblems represent history, but also abstract values. You don't have to pick random symbols and hope people understand what you mean. There are certain objects that are universally understood to mean certain things. For example, a heart represents the abstract concept of love. Ancient crests often made use of the same symbols, and historians have recorded what they were said to mean. For example, in medieval times, an open book in a crest was said to represent the pursuit of knowledge. Harvard makes use of this symbol in their crest. Here are some more examples of symbols and their meanings. A bear means protection, a harp denotes Irish origin, and the sun represents glory. The lily represents purity, prosperity, and good luck. They are often used in weddings to symbolize well wishes. The Ouroboros symbolizes rebirth. It is an ancient, eternal cycle. We see it as a reminder to work with what we have and learn from our predecessors. The nightingale is the voice of the natural world. They are known for their clear, prevailing song. It is associated with poetic creativity. The ivy plant is evergreen and symbolizes fidelity. It represents strength and endurance, the ability to stick to our values. Using this info, I created the first iteration of our crest. I chose to modernize it with clean, sharp lines rather than the detailed illustrations many crests have. At the top, you see the letters ERM, which stands for our Economic Rights Movement. ERM is dedicated to helping normal people achieve generational wealth despite barriers. We are the voice of many, as shown in the Nightingale. We do not yield, as shown in the ivy. We learn from the past so as not to create the same mistakes, as shown in the Ouroboros. And finally, the lily is a well wish for good luck, prosperity, and pure intentions. Many crests have a motto that sum up their values. They are often written in Latin. Always Forward is based on a quote that reminds us to dream about the future and make it happen so that we'll never dream backwards at what we could have done. If you would like to create your own crest, check out these resources I've provided. Be sure to check us out at housingjv.com and subscribe to this channel for weekly content.